My name is Delia Popa. I'm a senior fellow at the Migration Policy Institute. The Institute is an organization that's dedicated to the study of the movement of people around the world. The particular unit that I work in, the National Center for Im uh, Immigration Integration a Policy, focuses on the integration of families into U.S. society. In particular, we work on education. Our project uh, this time around through the accelerator was focusing on the issue of accountability and assessment. We really believe as an organization that in order to be counted and to be responded to, immigrant and English learner children must be part of the accountability system in a way that tells schools, educators, and parents what students know, not just what they don't know, and then also identifies what students need to improve their learning and to give them the best possible educational situation. What was interesting about our participation in the uh, accelerator group, we were focused on measurement, accountability, assessment, and what was interesting about it to us as a group, as an organization, and that supports accountability and assessment is the different takes by the different groups. We were all on the side of accountability and assessment is a good thing, but everybody was responding to a different community issue. And what we were able to learn from that as a group is a way to question ourselves. Uh, we almost had aha moments about, oh, we hadn't thought about that, or oh, we should look at that. And uh, it wasn't so much about a common, very specific issue, but the common thought process about the broader topic of assessment and measurement and accountability. Uh, that was very useful to us as we did our own particular work. Well, the results of our uh, participation in the project uh, this time around, have really helped us focus on how you get information to people that is meaningful in decision-making about accountability and assessment. I think it reinforced the notion for us that we don't want to tell families what they should do or what policy they should put. More, it's important to us that they have the information they need to be able to make the decisions about their particular child. I think what was reinforced for us as an outcome from this project is that there's so many view, different viewpoints and so many specific situations. The question we should be asking is how do we hang on to what's good yet allow for communities to make decisions for themselves that work? Well, the future of uh, measurement, uh, assessment and accountability will all be always be with us at MPI. It, we believe it is an important feature in the education of English learners and immigrant students. By federal law, assessment is what identifies a student as an English learner. So it's sort of key part of the, the part of the makeup of the group we work with, but making sure there is a fair and responsive system of accountability that supports what children know and allows educators to key in on that and then allows educators to discover where the gaps are so that we can support students will always be part of what we do and we will continue with this work because we don't think we have all the answers yet in terms of the perfect way to create a, a system that does that for all children. What we got from it is um, a broader view of the accountability issue from the from the perspective of local um, local organizations that were addressing local issues. So it gave us a broader understanding of the complexity. Um, my advice to future participants in an accelerator group is keep your mind open to what you're learning. We're not always going to be as, as colleagues able to work on the very same concrete issue, but there is a lot we're learning from each other, from each other's circumstances and how we address them.